this beautiful and lovely school, Meridian College, Mem Herber, our mom, and to the entire team, colleagues seated here with us. It is indeed my single, singular, unique, and sacred honor to stand here before you and say just a few words. Before I untangle the knot, Mem Herber, allow me on behalf of my humble self and also on behalf of my alone together to straddle my saddle and turn me loose and furthermore let me wander over yonder on my old cayuse. There is a saying that says, it's a saying of course that says, every person is either a creator of fact or a creature of circumstances. He either puts color into his environment or like a chameleon, takes color from his environment. Or to put it in another way, some people are thermometers. They conform completely to their environment. Their behavior is definitely determined from without. Other people are thermostat. Instead of allowing their environment to control them, they determine the environment. Meridian College is the same thermostat and not a thermometer. Meridian College is not a chameleon. You don't take color from your environment. Colleagues, in conclusion, our greatest songs are still unsung. Never be discouraged when you make progress, no matter how slow. Most of the stumbling blocks people complain about are under their heads. Value the little things. One day, you may look back and realize they were larger things. Ngoveni always speak less than you know, because sometimes you have to be quiet in order to be heard. Lastly, Mem Herber, when history absolves you, you will say, Vedi, Vini, Vinci. I came, I saw, and I conquered. I thank you very much. And I am also donating these three books to this lovely school. One, titled The Heat of Your Silence, authored by me. The second book, it's Delayed Gratification, Your Future is Better Than Your Background. And the third one is titled Dire Consequences. Don't take life seriously, it's not permanent. I rest my case, case being my name.